Hi guys, Simon here. Beautiful sunny day here in the UK. 16 degrees, nice. I got mail, and we'll do that ladyboy story after it. Just a short story. What's going on? Look. Shit. Another one. Another one. Another one. And Simon looks trendy. I've got a hoodie on. And it's got nice metal tags. What's this all about? Well, when you've got a YouTube channel, sometimes companies approach you and ask you to have a look at their products and maybe review them. Now I've had quite a few as the channel's growing, but it's usually milkshakes or vitamins or all these weird stuff that I don't do. But this one company got in touch with me, um, Charles Wilson, and said, we're gonna send you a couple of clothes, have a look, see what you think. And we've got something for your subscribers. Okay, piqued my interest. So it arrived, parcel, and opened it got the hoodie on today. I will try this other stuff, see what the quality is like. Hoodie, amazing quality. But why did this company stand out to me and I thought I'll do it? Two things. Their website is brilliant. The quality of their clothes looks good. So far looks brilliant. Looks good on the website and the prices are low. But they've given me a code, coupon code, which gives you guys 20% off their prices. And they're already low prices. But the biggest thing on their posh bags, I'll read it because uh, all our products are covered by a 90 day no quibble guarantee. Our guarantee is unconditional. You can send the item back whether you've worn it or not. However, we do ask you to try the garments. 90 day guarantee, no quibble. So that's worth a look and it looks great. So, Charles Wilson, I'll put under here, I think it's cwclothes.co.uk and the coupon is Simon LOS, Simon Loss, 20% discount. I'll do an update in a few days, but Charles Wilson, thank you very much. Looks good. Love these shirts. Really smart. And I like the logo, it looks like an RAF logo. Can you see the logo there, that round? Looks like the old uh, Aria for an Air Force. Good stuff. There's a freebie. And I'll do a review. When I got the, my website is a couple of weeks away, we'll put a Charles Wilson clothes page on there for you guys to have a look at as well. Hmm. No clothes for the missus. That's going to cheese her off. Yes. Okay, Ladyboy. It's only a short Ladyboy story, so I didn't think it was worth doing a whole video. But I mentioned about hat yai and jazz bars and stuff. Someone today sent me a message on the comments. When's the hat yai lady boy story? So here you go. I had left the bar scene. I was living in Bangkok with my missus, girlfriend at the time, weren't married. A friend of mine came over, Dan, and that's his real name. Uh, got himself a girlfriend, part time of course. And me and the missus were gonna do a road trip. Um, and Dan said, I'm coming along. So four of us, Bangkok, jumped on a plane, hat yai, checked in a hotel. I shot off, did a visa run, come back. Evening, into the bars, and the bars in hat yai, brilliant. Uh, jazz bar, so did food, draft beer, lovely, jazz band playing. Couple of hours in there drinking, great time was had by all. Crossed the road, and down some steps, big open doors, down the steps into a rock bar. Another couple of hours drinking, rock band, brilliant music. Dan was drunker, is that a word, drunker? More, he had, he was, he was drunk. No, I wasn't as bad, but he was very drunk. The girls drunk. So, come out up the steps, and it was late, it was maybe one, two in the morning, come up out the steps. So the rock bar is down below us, down the steps. This building here is a block. It's a superstore. So a big shopping centre. Behind it is a 
the lane runs around the back of it and then behind that lane is another superstore. Our hotel is just around that corner there, around the block, on the side of the road and around that side is a McDonald's. Burger King, McDonald's, McDonald's. You know, you have a drink, you want food. Guys, food, women, nah. So, women start walking round that way to the hotel. Me and Dan round that way. Come round the corner and we can see McDonald's in front of us, 50 yards on the right. There's the lane, about five or 10 yards, which cuts through to our hotel. Brilliant. We're not that drunk. Over on the right is a hotel, like a ramp going up to a car park and then either an alley or some doors to a club or something and then McDonald's. Outside these doors was a large amount of lady boys. Now, I was drunk. However, my memory seems to think there were more than a 20 plus lady boys. I don't think I'm exaggerating because I remember there was quite a large crowd, a lot of lady boys. Why were they there? Was it a lady boy convention? Maybe a, a lady boy stag night, one of them getting married, or is it called a hen night? Or hat yeah, just got a load of lady boys. Comments, guys, you know better than me. There might be Malaysian lady boys or Cambodian lady boys. Yeah, loads of them. Dan and me walking up the road towards McDonald's. We look up, we see this lot. We're a couple of meters from the lane. What's my friend Dan do? He's like a son to me. He's like 20 years younger than me. He's drunk. What's he do? Go on. He wolf whistles. Now his wolf whistle, it's not just the, you know, his fingers in loud. Two o'clock in the morning, wolf whistles at the lady boys. His girlfriend's around the corner and he's wolf whistling. He thought that was highly amusing. Again, my memory, my memory seems to think that they all ran towards us. I grabbed him and said, run, and we went down the lane. And my memory seems to think they chased us down the lane, throwing stuff at us and shouting. But I'm probably gonna say, more than likely, I grabbed him and said, run, and dragged him down the lane, and they probably stayed at the end and shouted. The echo of the lane made it sound worse. As we're running down the lane, the wife and girlfriend just about caught us up at the end of the lane. They, they were walking up towards the hotel. They were there looking down, boyfriends running towards them behind lots of lady boys shouting and cheering and whatever. They were laughing their socks off. No socks, just shirts. And we legged it down, and suffice to say, it, it was scary. <laughs> we were drunk, you know, lots of lady boys. It was funny. Now it's funny as hell thinking about it. They probably just walked across the road, started shouting at us. But you can imagine they, if they were in a club and they hadn't got a partner for the night, two guys walk around the corner whistling at them. They're going to think, ah, this is the golden egg, this is jackpot. Grab them. I dread to think what would have happened if he hadn't whistled and we'd got to McDonald's and then we'd come out. They would have been all over us. I remember my heart was in my mouth running down that lane. Scary. Oh my. We went straight to the hotel. Oof. Lots and lots of lady boys in Hat Yai. Loads of them. Never seen so many. Even in the big shows, there was more in Hat Yai. So if you guys are into lady boys, do a search on Hat Yai. Maybe you can. Battery went on me right at the end of the video. Can you believe it? <coughs> yeah, so there you go. Guys, you have a look. Hat Yai. Tell me what you think. I'll put the links underneath about uh, cwclothes.co.uk and the co coupon code, capital letters I believe guys, Simon LOS. I'll double check on the email, I'll put it down in the description below. Go and check them out. And if any of you creators, 
email me and I'll put you in touch with this company and uh, maybe you can have a look at the stuff as well. Just a quick video. There you go. I got mail. Ladyboy story short. See you on the next video. This I might put this one up today. Yeah, I'll put this one up today. Live stream. I'm looking at doing my first proper live stream this Saturday, 13th of May, at 7 in the evening. So it's 1900 UK time. Um, I got my microphone arrived, my second hand microphone. Just got to set it up, test it. So, all being well. Saturday, 7 o'clock, live stream, Q&A. A couple of hours. So have a think in the meantime, any questions you want to ask. And, yeah, I'll see you on the live stream. Brilliant. Bye for now. Ta-da.